Hi guys, Alpha here and welcome back to another video. So today's video is the second one in the ETS2 for beginners series and today I will be showing you how to download and install the ProMods map. So if you don't know what ProMods map is, um, it's pretty much the best quality map mod that you can download for ETS2 right now. I definitely recommend everyone who has the game to also download this mod because this really makes the game so much better. It adds just so much content. So one thing to note though is that if you want to download and install the map you're gonna have to have the Going East DLC, the Scandinavian DLC and the Viva La France DLC. So that's kind of a setback but at the same time it's totally worth it. So let us begin with the video. So first of all to download the map uh, you have to go to the promods.net forum um, that's the only place you can download this map so if you're gonna see some other links somewhere online they are most probably fake and they're not official ones so the only official link is promods.net so once you arrive on the website first things first you're gonna have to make an account so that's pretty straightforward just here on the top right hand corner go and um, click on register, agree to the terms and make your account. Also activate the account with your email, that's pretty straightforward, I think everyone can do that. And after that you're gonna have to log into your account. Now once you're in your account, you can see here on the top left corner uh, some new links have appeared. So click download from here obviously and you will have this new installation page. So First of all, obviously choose your language, I always keep it in English and click OK. Now this is the first part, you're gonna have to generate your own definition file for the map. So click here on uh, this link which says click here to generate your definition file, click on here and it will open a new tab for you. So you can change some settings here if you want, but I usually keep everything as it is. You can read through them and it's pretty straightforward, it shouldn't be confusing to anyone. And yeah, if you're using Rust map, I guess you're gonna have to check this box here. But today's video is about only pro mods, so we're not going to do that. So once you have chosen all your settings, you wanna go here and click generate. It will download a uh, definition file for you. So um, that's the first step done and you can close out of this tab. Now, coming back to this, uh, click here to go to step 2 and here's the place where you can download the map itself. So you have two options here. You can either pay one dollar and you can get the full file, map file in one download or you can download it for free but you have seven parts. So if you have one dollar to spare I would highly recommend to you to pay that and download the mod in one file but if you do not have that uh, it's okay uh, you can just download it in seven separate parts and the only real setback here is that first you have only max of three concurrent downloads so you can't download more than three files at the same time and also it says that the max uh, speed is 200 kilobytes per second so that's pretty bad but generally it's gonna take you about maybe an hour to download it so it's not too bad I guess and to download it what you have to do is just click on the link here uh, it will go to the add fly page so it's gonna show some sort of ads here most probably but don't worry it's not harmful for your computer or anything like that you're just gonna wait until this yellow button here saying skip ad appears and once this appears you just click on that and it will start downloading the map for you. So you can close out of the tab and you're gonna have to do this for the whole seven parts. So let us move on to the next step. So now once you have downloaded all the parts or the full archive uh, you will first of all have obviously your definition file and then this is what you will have as well. So seven parts here, um, I recommend you guys download if you don't have it. Uh, go 
to Google and download WinRAR and install it. So it's a very good program and it's going to help us unpack this thing today. So once you have downloaded the program, come back here, obviously install it first, then come back here and click here on the first one, which should, you know, you should be able to open that. All the other files are in like a weird format, but the first one should work. So click on it and here you will be presented with um, five, not five, uh, six files. So all you have to do is uh, select all of them and drag and drop them to a folder somewhere. So and once the extraction is done, you will have all the required files. You're gonna want to put them all into the its 2 mod folder. Uh, if you don't know where it is or how to do it, then refer back to my last video which showed how to install mods and the next part is to actually go into the game and activate so let us do just that so once you're in game what you want to do is open up the mod manager and then we want to activate each mod file separately so you can see on the screen right now how you should do it uh, you're gonna have to have the right load order so make sure that on the right side of the mod manager you have all the files in the right order just like on the screen right now so and once that is done all you have to do is click confirm changes and you are done and this is how you install promods so it's not that complicated the only thing is you have to look out for the load order so if that's correct the game should work just fine and you can enjoy pro mods so thanks for watching guys hopefully it was helpful for you guys and you enjoyed the video and if you did you know what to do leave a like rating maybe comment if you want to and please subscribe so again thanks very much for watching guys and i'll see you in the next video